In this video, I'll show you how to download and install Darktable on a Windows computer. Just go ahead and search for Darktable. It's all one word. I'll include the link in the description of this video as well. The website is darktable.org, and this is what it looks like. At the top, along the menu bar, there's a button or a tab called Install. We'll click there, and it brings up a bunch of different um, these squares or different operating systems we can install on. Click this one that has the Windows logo on it. And then we'll just click download the latest installer for Darktable. This will give us the latest version and it just starts our download automatically uh, running on our computer. I already have mine downloaded so I'm going to um, go to that downloads location on my computer. By default my downloads go to my downloads directory. It's probably the same for you and we see this Darktable Win64 installer. Go ahead and left click that and it will uh, open up and start the install process. So we'll have to agree to the terms and conditions. This is the location we save it at. We just keep clicking next here. Uh, keep these boxes checked and click install. And then the install process is um, fairly quick. And there we go, Darktable is now installed. So we can just click finish. To launch Darktable, we can just uh, click on the start menu in the bottom left hand corner and start typing in Darktable. And it will show up as an app installed on our computer. If we want to, we can do the same thing uh, and right click and go to pin to start or pin to taskbar. It's also possible to create a desktop launcher if you want to do that. In that case, we'll do the same thing. We'll find it in the uh, menu launcher and then we can right click and go to open file location. This shows us where the launcher is and we can just copy this to our desktop. It also has the option for uninstall if we want to do that. But I'll just right click and go copy and then right click on my desktop and go paste. And now I can quickly open Darktable from anywhere on my computer. Thanks for watching. Check out the next tutorial where we'll learn how to start using Darktable.